Divers here back at it again with another episode for you all. If you are new to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button to join the dumpster squad. And please don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. So last night we went out pretty late, but we found some pretty neat things. And as you guys see, we found a table. I'm gonna go ahead and discuss that last. So we're gonna do with all this small stuff first. But anyways. Um, we found some stuff from a home decor stores and also our local book supply store. So let's go ahead and jump right into it. So I'm going to start off with the home decor stuff. I kind of have it mixed in with the book supply store stuff, but I'm just going to start grabbing. I'll tell you guys where everything is exactly. So as you guys see, we found a lot of the stuff from the store and this is just a um, picture frame. It's missing the back and the glass, but you can easily just... Oh, you can easily just go get another one from like a another store like a really cheap one and just stick it on the back of there but that is the frame i like how it's like wood really nice like natural grain finish not exactly sure what this is but it looks like there was something on top of it before but i think i'm still gonna keep it and might like mess with it maybe i'll do like a little diy with it not exactly sure what i'm gonna do 100 percent with it and then here is also another frame also the wood kind of this one kind of reminds me of like a palette like a wood palette but um pretty neat it's like a dark finish to it and then we found a snow globe um stocking holder and i think the price tag they didn't clear it it was 12.99 and the only thing wrong with it is for some reason half of the water is missing which is really odd because it isn't leaking anywhere. And also the reindeer is broken, but I do like how it's like that birch looking tree to it. Really nice, but that sucks. It's like, just like kind of curious how this water disappeared from it. And a lot of stuff was frozen. So now I know what these globes look like. Here is another one. There is the price tag and there is nothing wrong with this one. This one is still slightly frozen as you guys can see, but it's like of a little, um, like I think they're Buddhas or like one, one of those um, gods and 
It's got like gold flakes in them. Really pretty, really nice, extremely, extremely heavy. And it was $14.99. Let me go ahead and scoot that out of the way. Found a charger. Let's see, price tag $4.99 for it. And this was where we found a perfume called Casual. Never really heard of this before. Not sure what the price is, unfortunately, in it. But I'm pretty sure it is in there because it does seem pretty heavy. Yep, it is in there. That is crazy. But we did find a perfume. And also, like, this little candle holder birch-looking tree one. Still don't know the exact price to it, unfortunately. And then over here, we found a, like, one of those tension bath rod storage holders. It does says it's missing pieces, and it was open, but I'll just have to put it together and see if it really is missing anything, but it's really neat. We've had one of these before, but, um... I ended up breaking it somehow when I was cleaning the bathroom, unfortunately. So this will be perfect to go in our guest bathroom if it if it does completely work. And then, hey, Murphy. There's Murphy sniffing everything like usual. And then over here, we have stuff from the book supply store. Just a couple books and like, I think this is a, yeah, it's a board game. But we have a how to hug a porcupine, cute little porcupine. It was $6.98. Nothing really wrong with it. It is a little bit wet because it did rain the past few days. Here is another book. Little children's book. It was $12.99 for this one. Here's another children's book. Those little troll looking things, whatever they are. It was $7.98. And then the last thing from the book supply store is this board game. Really nice. It says it's uh, second edition. And it's ages 14 to adult for three to six players. And as you guys can see, it's from that popular TV show. Let me flip it over. So it's like a really interesting kind of board game not exactly sure like how I've never played anything like this before but it looks really neat as you guys can see in the back picture of it really cool I forgot to mention that we found two things from a craft supply store and all it is is these picture frames they the the glass is broken up a little bit but that is okay there is no price tag on it but it is 11 by 14 frame and we have another one the same type of style just also the glass is broken and then the last thing that we found my most favorite find of the night is this table that we found from a home decor store and look how nice it is it's that distressed farmhouse look and it's got these really detailed legs we did have to put it together but that's okay don't mind putting it in luckily all the pieces were there but the only thing that was wrong with it is that it is chipped right here. But they did have the pieces in the dumpster with it. And it was broken up in two pieces. And all I'm going to do is I'm going to use this wood glue like I have done before to fix things. And just reattach it. Get it on really tight. Let that dry maybe for about a day. And then go ahead and glue it to this part. Just gotta, it's like putting a puzzle together. You just got to get it right in the perfect spot and then I'm going to patch it up with some of that um, wood filler and then re-sand it and I have paint very similar to this color but this is a really nice table I love like the scoop design to it so like the table you know is centered off and then the border raises up a little bit so that's really nice so things don't fall over and I love how it's like the off white legs to it and it has like that center detail really really nice I hope this will work out. I know it's definitely going to work out. It's going to take me a few days to fix it, but I will definitely show you guys once I do fix it, how it's going to look. Cause I th I'm thinking about putting it in our coffee table right here and move this downstairs. But yeah, guys, this is everything we found. We found some pretty neat things. Still found some like little Christmas decor, more books and a ton of home decor. Definitely love this table. Can't wait to start working on it. I think I'm going to start working on it on my next day off. 
But yeah, guys, this is going to conclude this night's episode. If you guys are new to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button to join the Dumpster Squad. And please don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and tune in tomorrow night for another episode. Oh,